As you can see, Linux fans, I already have Audacity open and ready to use. Today I'm going to show you how to mix voice and music and export that as a single file. I'm going to first record my voice. Hello, this is Ken Hess and I pronounce Linux as Linux. There's the voice file. You can see it's in here as track one. Now we're going to add some music to it by finding some music and importing it. I have a file here called intro music and as you can see it imports into the file as the second track. Now I'm going to delete out quite a bit of this because I just want a little bit of music to go with my voiceover. And we come back over here now you can see the voice up here music down here. Now I can just tell by looking at the amplitudes that the music is much louder than my voice. So I'm going to highlight this, come up here to Effect, Amplify, which I know sounds opposite from what it should be, but it's really not, because I'm going to amplify it negatively. So I'm going to give it a negative 6 amplification, and you'll see it shrink. Now if we listen to both of these together, you'll get an understanding of, of what I've just done so that you can hear the voice over the music but the music is still there and it provides a fill for the voice. Hello this is Ken Hess and I pronounce Linux as Linux. There you can see how that works. Well we don't want to just end the music abruptly before we go on to something else over here in the recording so what we're going to do is fade this out. We're going to select an area that we want to start fading the music and then select effect, fade out, and you can see what it does. It decreases the amplitude all the way down to silence. So now let's select at the beginning and listen again. Hello, this is Ken Hess and I pronounce Linux as Linux. And then you can start talking in, in your recording or start talking in a live broadcast or, or teaching session, whatever you want. But that's how you create a professional voice over music with a fade out. Very simple, very elegant, and totally free. Have fun with Audacity. And before we go, I want you to see something. I want to see the people who have a lot of Audacity here. I don't know any of them, but I can tell you for sure that they have a lot of Audacity. And you should thank these people for their time. There's different projects that Audacity uses. Special thanks to these audacious people. And there you go. Thank you very much for listening. This is Ken Hess with Linux Magazine.